Hello everybody and welcome to Yamwise. I'm just a regular hobbit. In fact, I'm just a gardener. I've got some tasks to do today, so let's get started. I think someone needed some stew delivered, so I'm gonna get working on that right now. Um, just woke up today, so I'm a little drowsy. Let me figure out where I'm going first. Oh, that's right. Someone told me that I need to go deliver some stew today. So let's go and talk to them. I think her name was Blinza. Blinza said she had some stew to deliver. Um, the gaffer told me I had to get started on this, so let's get going. But then I just remembered I have a bunch of stuff I need to deposit into the bank. So let's go deposit my items into the bank. Just a regular Saturday morning for me. And so I've got all these bags that were given to me, so I have to deposit in the bank. Got to make sure they don't get stolen. Don't know what's in them yet, but they weigh a bunch. So let's unload the bags and lighten our load today. We need a bag of food though, because we'll get hungry on our trip today. We have some errands to run, so let's get started on the errands. Okay. So, like I said, we had some stew to deliver. Let's deliver some stew. Blinza said she needed stew. Okay, so let's talk to her. Hello, Yamwise. Welcome. Cards or drinks? Have fun. Well, I know she's got some stew. Alright, so I was told that there's a hungry deputy. The gaffer sent us down here to talk to Blinza. So, Blinza, we need to take your stew over to the guy. Oh, she gave me the stew, so this is what we need to work on. We have carrot stew, and there's a deputy who's got shift tonight. However, he forgot his lunch. So we're going to deliver his stew to him so he can carry out his duties. So, Deputy Lomot. Okay, hurry up. The stew's getting cold. We will do that. So deputy Lomot's going to be working in the bank, I think. There he is. Let's get started. Here's your stew, sir. Awesome, we got some experience for work. All right, now we just deposited stuff in the bank. We got some money now, finally we got some money. All right, now we got a dagger and money. Let's go talk to the gaffer, see what's going on today. I have some bad news to report. I was talking to the gaffer, asking him what he wanted me to work on today, and he says the garden was destroyed by orcs. Overnight, a bunch of orcs from Crushbone came in and stole all the crops, trampled our crops, they broke our carrots, they peed on our plants, and they stole the seeds. If we don't get these seeds back, we're going to be starving this winter, and we're going to have no way to pay for rent. Guys, I have to go set out and find the seeds, and Emperor Crush is holding them. Let's get out there. Oh my gosh, it's so dark out here. I don't have a lantern. Let's run back. Hopefully, maybe maybe we can deliver more stew and get some money to buy a lantern or a candle or something. I can't see where I'm going, guys. Blenza, can we take some more stew? Ah, she gave me more stew. Okay. We need more money. I need a candle, a lantern. I have never found a way out there. It's too dark. Lomont, do you need more stew? Where do you go? Oh, here you are. I hope he's still hungry. Yes, we got two more silver. Maybe we can buy a lantern or a candle, something. I do not want to go out, it's too dark. All right, everyone, I found enough money to buy a torch. I want to have a large lantern, but I don't have enough money yet. So let's buy a torch, that's better than nothing. Now I feel safe enough to go out in the dark. Oh, I actually bought two of them. 
I'm so nervous, guys. I bought two t torches. All right. Now, if I don't have enough money, I'll have to buy a fishing pole to start fishing. Gaffer's depending on me, so let's get out of here. Ooh. All right. Fool's gold. We have to go out in town. No time for fool's gold. Okay, at least I can see better now. Someone told me there's Bixies out here and goblins and snakes and things, so let's start. Well, we gotta start sharpening our dagger. I've never fought before, so let's get started on something easy. I have to work on my skills. Oh, that looks too strong for me. Large rat. Okay, we'll fight a large rat. Oh, there's a Bixie. I heard these are easier. Yeah. Oh, he attacked me. I didn't know they were mean. Let's see what skills I have. Oh, I finished my first fight. That was easy. Okay, now. Okay. I wonder if I can attack it and kill a snake. A moss snake. I'll have to find out. Gaffer taught me how to hide. And he taught me how to sneak. We'll have to make sure we hide and sneak whenever it's appropriate. I also learned that eventually I can backstab it right now. We don't quite know how to do it. I'd much rather be in the garden right now. I'll tell you that for sure. So far, so good. I've never been out of town. What's here? Hmm. A snake thing. Okay. Well, there's nothing for us to buy or sell at the moment. I wonder if I can fight a wolf. If I get in trouble, I can run back to the guards. Let's not stay too far from the guards. That wasn't too bad. Maybe I'll take everything I can so we can sell it and buy something to make it stronger. I could use some armor. I heard spiders give silk. I could use silk to make armor. Or I could use silk to sell. I wonder if I try to fight something too strong. All that gardening made me strong though. I have 130 strength at the moment. However, I didn't do much studying. My intelligence is really low at 67 because I just focused mostly on gardening. There was no time for school. I know everything there is about gardening. This is actually pretty fun. Killing snakes and wolves and rats and bixies. I actually like this. I heard there's a gate, a big wall. I don't think I'm ready to go across the wall, but if I kill a couple more of these things, maybe I'll get strong enough to go over there. The way out of Misty Thicket is blocked by a dungeon I heard called Runny Eye. 
I don't think I can kill the goblins or any eye, but maybe I can sneak past them. I have sneak and hide. When Gandalf comes into town, I like to hide in the garden and eavesdrop. Last week, Gandalf was in town. I heard him talking about Crushbone. <laughs> right, let's kill some more spiderlings. So far, this isn't so bad. Almost as fun as Garden. <laughs> I'll tell you, once I can get to Crush Bone, I'm going to take out Umper Crush and I'm going to get our seeds back. <laughs> and the gaffer's going to be so happy. We got to do this quickly because I have to go back and work on the gardens. So we're going to be focused on getting our seeds back and taking our revenge against Emperor Crush. The only problem is, he's way over in a different continent. And I've never left Misty Thicket before. In fact, I've never been across the wall. Wow, we got stronger. Okay. Oh, queen. I'm not fighting no queen. Let's fight rats. All right. So there's a big rock over there, and there's a guard tower. I always wanted to go up in that. Let's go take a look at it. I want to see what's inside. If there's anything dangerous, I should probably sneak up there. Let's see if I can hide. Ooh. Oh, my sneak failed. Apparently I'm not that good at it yet. Let's keep working at it. Oh, snakes. I don't like snakes. Although the garden snakes do take care of rodents. I hate rodents and I hate snakes, but I hate rodents worse. hate anything that eats my crops. Those are usually mammals, small mammals. All right, what's up these stairs here? Ooh, can I get up there? Yes, I can. Sure, I'm glad I got this torch, otherwise I wouldn't see where I'm going. We do have good eyesight though, much better than humans. But, not as good as the Dark Elves, and I've never met a Dark Elf yet. Or, a, or the High Elves. They're kind of stuck up. You can't trust the Dark Elf and the High Elves are stuck up. However, I would like to meet some. And we'll meet some when we go across to the other continent. However, that's run by the Wood Elves. Wood Elves are pretty cool. Alright, Bixie. So the Bixies, I don't know what their problem is. They just don't like me very much. So if I can't be a gardener, I think I'll be a burglar. And uh, I know there's a group of people that hang out by the bank and they can teach me more about hiding and sneaking. Maybe we should talk to them and learn more about hiding and sneaking. Maybe they could even teach me about backstabbing. I even heard that there's burglar guilds in Greater Fae. They have some, because wood elves can also become burglars. Although I've never met a wood elf in real life yet. So we'll have to find out. I trust the rumors are true, so we'll go across there and see. However, first I have to get across the wall, and then I have to sneak past the goblins to leave this area. I heard that you can then travel. We'll have to sneak past a lot of dangerous areas. So I'll use my sneaking ability. We may even have to go through high pass. Luckily, I have a sneak skill so I can get there safely and we won't have to fight any kind of dangerous things. There are orcs in there, but I don't think I'll be safe enough to fight them, so we'll just sneak past them. I wish I had Bilbo's ring and then we can completely hide through there, but then we have to worry about ring rays, so <laughs> we don't want to do that. So let's go back and talk to the burglar guild and see what we can do. They might have some skills for us and something to teach us. Now that we're level two, they might be impressed by me. I think I'd be too ashamed to go stand in front of them at level one. All right, so we're good on food. 
We have a torch. I have some things to sell. And where the heck are the guild? Hmm. I think they're in the fool's gold. Maybe they're up at the very top because they're not welcome at the bottom level. So they, I heard they hang out here. Let's go see. I wonder if there are burglars up here. Oh. Well, let's see. Deep pockets. That sounds like a burglar name to me. All right. Here we go. He says he can teach me some skills. I can learn backstab at 10. Bind wound. Ooh. At the moment, we're fine, but we might need to start working on healing ourselves, but maybe later. Height skills 50. Since heading, let's put a point into it. Swimming. I don't like falling in the water. I want to swim out, so let's put some skills into that. Begging? No, I'm not a beggar. All right, the rest of the points I think I'll put into since heading. Well, no, we'll put it into swimming. There we go. Okay, we have nothing to learn from him. The next time I need to come back and talk to this guy is level 4 for dodge and 5 for picklock. We don't need picklock. Pickpockets would be nice. The only people I would actually steal from are orcs, I think. All right, guys. Heading out of town. Let's work on getting stronger and crossing the big wall. Well, now that I sold the wolf meat or the wolf fur, I actually have enough money. I think I could actually buy a lantern now. I want a big lantern. Let's go find a big lantern. I forgot who sold lanterns. Well, it turns out there's not much to do except for fight a bunch of things and get further in to Misty Thicket so we can eventually cross the, the wall. I don't think it's safe to leave until we at least can pass the wall. Once I pass the wall, I can sneak past all everything dangerous and we can get over to Greater Fay. I'll stay around long enough and let's fight Bixie drones and beetles and everything here. Once I feel like I've harnessed all my skills, we can leave this area. I'm collecting Bixie wings and killing wolves. Feeling much more confident now. I need to go back and see if there's any fur on that wolf. I don't see any other burglars around. Now I almost have enough to get a large lantern. I have to get one more gold first. Uh, you can stack these. I'll loot that, we can stack them. Bats are too easy. A giant rat, we'll fight the giant rat. It's supposed to be hard and strong, but I've been given some strong spell effects. So they should help me out. But that rat is almost as big as me. Holy cow. The gaffer gave me a bunch of food, and it's almost time for a second breakfast. After second breakfast, we have 11 Z's. So we'll have to carry a lot of food with this. Fighting makes me hungry. Oh, look at that. There's a guy walking around with a small beetle behind him. I need to go talk to him. I wonder what he's doing. Uh-oh, wolf. Darn it.
Ugh. Let's go see what he's doing because he's got a little beetle behind him. Ember. He says, have you seen the wonderful assortment of spiders and beetles that I have at the ticket? If you have an extensive bug collection. So I heard about this guy. He does a bug collection quest, but it turns out you have to be higher level to complete at minimum. So I won't be able to do that. We have to focus on getting to greater fey first. Otherwise, I'd be working on collecting the beetle parts and the bug parts and giving it to them. But I don't have time for that. So right now, I'm just going to keep stabbing things. And I need to practice my sneaking skills because we'll eventually have to sneak past all the goblins. If they catch me, I'm doomed. So I'm halfway through level 2 already. If we can fight things that are strong, we can level up quicker. I wish there were more quests that I can work on. I heard in Kinos there's tons of quests you can do. Someone even told me, and I agree with it, that it's the best starting zone in the game. I don't even know how strong orcs are. I'll have to look it up and see how strong orcs are. The orcs and Crushbone. I'll stay and fight as long as I have to, though. Why do I keep getting knocked back? I know there's small orcs out in front of Crushbone, so we can fight the small ones first, and then we'll tackle the big ones later. There's lots to do in Crushbone, and there's lots of things we can get. We'll get there eventually. We have to start out small, but we'll eventually we'll be very powerful. A large rat. Yeah, I'll fight these. Strongest things I can find because I seem to be pretty good at fighting. Crafter is casting a spell. Wonder where she's going in such a hurry. Nothing is dropping coins out here. There's another drum beetle. All right, I'm still level two. If I keep fighting these beetles, I'll be level 3 in no time. Have you guys seen my feet? Oh, those bats are strong. Let's fight some. I wonder if I'm strong enough at level 4 to go fight the orcs. bad is stronger than I expected I say that oh my god a Bixie what should I fight should I fight the Bixie let's kill the Bixie first I don't want to get stung left and right okay Bixie 
I keep noticing that my defense is going up. The longer I fight this bat, the stronger I'm getting. Oh, I forgot to attack. Darn it. Don't stop fighting. I think I'll be okay. I'm not leaving the misty thicket until I get at least a large lantern. Because I have no idea how dark it's going to get out there. Oh my gosh, that was so close. We did it. There's another strong bat. Oh, they drop coins. And a Bixie Stinger. I'm going to have to leave it because I ran out of bag space. I think I'll have to go back to town and buy a lantern. After I get the lantern, I think I'm, I think I'll be able to leave. I just have to make sure I train up my sneaking skills and we can leave this area. Oh, there's a goblin over there. I'll go fight that goblin. Goblin whelp. Oh, he saw me. Bring him over here. We're level three now. I'm going to go back to town and buy a lantern. I think it's safe enough to sneak past the goblins. Let's go talk to the burglars first and see if they can give me any hints and tips. And then we'll set forth. We'll leave the wall and we'll go into Runny Eye. I'm not planning on fighting. I can sneak and hide. Maybe they can train me to get a little better at it. We're back in town, let's go into Fool's Gold. Oh, there's a dwarf in here. What can he teach me? I could learn how to dodge things in one more level. Can I get better at sneak? No, I can't get better at sneak. Well, that's all I can do. I think I'll go across the wall now. I'm a little nervous about leaving, but we have to do it. We have to leave this area. Let's make a jump of faith. Leap of faith. We can do it. Well, I talked to the vendor, he said he was all out of lanterns. He said, just go with the torch, you'll be fine. I guess we'll be fine. The burglars also told me that, although I may fail at sneaking, just keep practicing and I'll get better. As long as I practice, I'll be able to be okay. And they said, go ahead and go across Riverville, sneak past the goblins and you'll be fine. They also told me to sneak past the orcs and high pass and I'll be fine. As long as I practice my skills, and take my time and be patient, I'll be okay. So we're gonna trust them and we're gonna set out now. We're leaving Misty Thicket. 
I got the blessings of the Gamji and we're gonna head out and he says please don't come back until you bring the seeds we have to replant the garden it's the planting season and we have to hurry up so I've got a mission and people are depending on me so let's set out let's leave and go across the big wall I've never been across the wall before in my life but I've been given directions on how to get to the place I need to go and we may have to take a boat to get there so let's do that now <laughs> 